Okay, in this screencast, I'm going to show you how to pin an assignment, a syllabus, a, a folder to a specific spot in your Schoology course page so that it does not move every time you enter something new. Okay, so to get going with that, let's go ahead and log in. And again, this is specifically for courses only. So once you are logged in, go to your course page. Uh, choose any class that you might want. In this case, I'm going to choose my geometry class. And let's say I want to put, um, anyway, I see, I see that I have the 14th, the 15th, the 19th, and I have the 13th, that sort of thing. Let's say that I re just realized too late that there is an August 18th. It's, it's not true in this particular case, but let's just say there is. You notice that, that when I go between these two spots, my cursor brings up a green dotted line with a little green cross at the end. If you were to click on that, you would be able to add any of these materials, a folder, assignment, a quiz, a link, a page, etc., etc., so that it would stay in that spot. Now, let me just show you what that looks like practically. Let's just say I want to add a folder. I want to call it, um, let's say, August 18th, okay, just for the heck of it. August 18th, 2019. I'm just going to create it. Don't worry about publishing it or anything else like that. And you'll notice that it sh shows up specifically between the 15th and the 19th. Now, if I had not gone onto that green line and added the material there, let me show you what would happen. So let me go ahead and delete this. And I'm just going to go. There we go. Just delete. And I'm going to go to my add materials up here. And I'm going to put in August 19th. <clears throat> so add materials, folder. I'm going to put in August 19th again, or 18th rather. I could type, it would be easier and create it. Now watch what happens. Where does it appear? It appears all the way at the bottom of the page, August 18th. And that's what happens in Schoology. If you don't designate where you want that particular uh, folder or assignment or whatever you're putting in there to appear, if you don't designate it, it will always appear at the bottom of the page. Now, at the beginning of a school year, it's not that big a deal because you'll still be able to see just on your real estate, on your screen, right, any new thing that you put in. However, as the semesters go on, right, you're gonna, your kids and you will start to have to scroll and scroll and scroll and scroll down to the bottom of the page to see what the new assignment or the new um, uh, folder is, okay? So remember, find an area where you want to specifically place something so that it does not move and then just go in between the boxes like so here's a here's a unpublished box here's a published one for example so i see here's a green dotted line here's a green dotted line here's a green dotted line and you can pin whatever you would like to that spot okay i hope that was helpful to you